building should be something that the neighborhood is proud of. And I think that the neighborhood here is extremely proud of how this building looks. Mary Lyon and the building itself make me feel inspired. It's an environment that allows everybody to feel comfortable, but it makes you feel warm and safe too when you walk in. It's a diverse school. We serve kids who have what we call high impact needs. We specialize in serving children on the autism spectrum. And those kids have some special needs that need to be addressed, both with the environment and with safety, to do their best learning. The Old Mary Lion was a 1920-ish lath and plaster cold box, or hot box, depending on the time of the year. We were very happy <laughs> to give up that old building to be able to create something new that would be more reflective of what our beliefs were about education and learning and it would enhance the neighborhood. Students got to create what their playground would look like. They got to create things that they thought should be in the building. So they realized, you know what, I have an opinion and just because I'm a student, adults listen to that. If a child has sensory issues, we have textures on the wall that they can touch and feel. So we took in all those aspects to fit all children, not just our children on the spectrum, but all children. Being able to open the nano wall to create a larger space for students and staff to be in really creates a sense of community. When there's a problem, this building allows us to figure out how to solve it. I'm getting to keep all 22 children because I was able to expand my room based on the architect's design of a nano wall. So now I have space at six feet apart for all 22 children. I love the natural light that this building provides. We have this whole bank of windows and I'm able to keep plants and help teach kids about science concepts. We're also just able to see so much of the community that it really helps you tie in the Pacific Northwest and what's happening outside of school. The grounds themselves, we've got all kinds of different native plants and shrubberies that we can look and observe and make observations, maybe grab a sample and take that back to the classroom and, and make further reflections on it. The Open Library is without question the heart of the school. Since day one, it's been considered the school's largest classroom. It was also where many of the stakeholders focused their attention. I think the tidal pools in particular are a great illustration of what the school wanted to create. Dynamic, embracing, and inspirational. I love the infusion of the Pacific Northwest into it. The river flows through the whole building, joining us together on every level. And to me, that's just a real solid piece of who we are as a community of learners. I think the school is awesome. My daughter absolutely loves it. She loves the teachers, she loves the students. Her learning has grown so much in the last year and a half. I think it's a great family-oriented environment here. This school makes me feel very joyful and happy every time I walk in. I finally feel like this is a place where I belong and you can see the value of the community in this building. That we can be creative and that our space gives us that, it's the best thing. I get calm in the library, I get excited when I'm walking through the classroom area and it makes me smile to see kids busy investigating things outside. It's a great place. You just you walk in and you go, ah, I'm home and I want to be here. This school makes me feel valued. This school makes me feel inspired. It makes me feel uh, free and inviting. It's unique. It's artistic, and it's something to be proud of for everybody. It makes me feel really good about having my kids in Tacoma School District. My school makes me feel awesome and cool because I like to learn here. 
My school makes me feel awesome and smart. I miss school.